Michelle's just told me I lost the plot because I said it's day one. It's not, it's actually day three. So day three on Hadrian's Wall. We're going from um, Trolliford all the way to Once Brood. Today actually it is 12 and a half miles. We've got about a mile walking along the road and then apparently today's scenery gets absolutely fantastic. Everyone's just getting their first stamps, so the stamps are outside in the boxes outside these places, which is great. So you just have to wait for it to be open. So if you want to be an early bird and go, then that's cool. The time now is about <laughs> about nine o'clock. So everyone's having fun. Sun's out, which is what we want. Low wind, double bubble for one of the prettiest days on the trail. Brilliant. We're uh, helping each other out, that's what it's all about. <laughs> Second slice of the wall. This one goes on quite a bit as well, doesn't it? Yeah, it's weird seeing it. Do your aeroplane thing. <laughs> This is our first proper like fort area, not really sure what it is, but I'm sure we'll soon find out. Now come and find out with me. What is it? Temple of Mithras. A temple of? Mithras. 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 Temple of Mish Mishrash. A spiritual journey. Right, so we're about six miles on and we just stopped for a coffee break. So we're walking along by here, we've had ambulances keep going up and down, so I'm not really sure what's going on there. Um, but this is like dips going in and out and up and down, it's quite boggy under underfoot, but can't beat this weather. We sort of split up, so there's we've got a group of nine and then there's another group that are ahead of us. So we're not quite at Halstead yet. But we've had a break already, just sitting and looking at the views, which has just been awesome. The only downfall, still next to the road. But anyway, right, I better catch up with everyone. See you next time. So this is a turret, co-site turret, apparently 33B officially on the wall. We have no idea really what a turret is. Probably abandoned less than a century after they were built. What is it though? Is Before it... the end of the second century. The mm -hmm. um, was, we now know what a turret was. So these square things are the things that we're walking on and that's what we're in right now. Alright, so this is Grindon Castle. And we'll have a look now and see what's left of the castle. I'm assuming not a lot. Yeah, no, not a lot. Can't imagine it though. I mean, what were they protecting views like this? Oh, I've got you sweating there. We're going down to the woods today. This is lovely. So peaceful. This is life.
Oh my word. This is actually quite steep, isn't it? Mm. It's amazing. Guys, what? So we're 10.7 miles in. Uh, we've literally just come, I don't know if you can see, all up and down those hills. We've got a little while to go. We're going to go all that way to Halstead, so we're not far away at all now. Uh, we're going to have a bit of a break. So, waiting for a few more to catch up. Uh, where are they? There they are. Right, catch you later. That's hard work, wasn't it? Yes. So, Rob. Are you forgiving us for bullying you into keeping your pack now? <laughs> <laughs> After that, come on. Right, go Nick! Oh, go Nick! Nick. Woohoo! The bully goat of the team. <laughs> He's mad! Very tired. Just got to watch where our feet get on this bit. There's Jan's down there. <laughs> Show me the way to go home. <laughs> go to bed. <laughs> right. So a quick roundup video of today. I'm absolutely shattered and uh, we end up walking about 14 miles which I know doesn't sound a lot but I mean you've seen the video it was like that and that and some parts of that trail were really really steep so well done to everybody uh, who, who actually walked this it was just absolutely amazing um, so far that's been my best day yet I mean the scenery was just out of, the, out of this world it was brilliant when you saw the wall numerous times it was like we followed the wall today uh, and you have a real feel of how the Romans built it when I mean, you saw the turrets and stuff like that as well. So um, you might notice I'm actually now in a completely different room. I've got a double bed. I'll give you a look round in a sec. Um, that's because I got given my room key, went into the other room that had like two beds. Literally, I got undressed and I was knocking on the door. I was like, what's going on? Uh, and it was Helen and Jan and I got their room so we had to swap rooms but I said you have to give me a minute I'm going to get dressed so yeah got me smeggy clothes back on so I'm going to go into uh, the bathroom I've got a bath um, so I'm going to have a soak in the bath but I'm going to wash all my clothes there's a hot warm radiator in there so I mean these dry really quick anyway 